Hello, everyone. Welcome to 10141 Summit Canyon. We are in the guard gated community known as Belisere. It is so beautiful. It's private. We've got a five bedroom, five bath home. It's been fully renovated. It is just over 5,000 square feet. I've been through it and it is gorgeous. Let's go check it out. Welcome. This home, right as you walk in, you just completely walk into this open formal room slash formal dining room. So you've got a really nice view of the backyard. You've got an open space to entertain. What I love also is this front door is so unique with the solid wood and the little peekaboo window in there. So you can come over here, you can put a nice sitting area. What I really like is this little nook which would technically be like a piano room or you know maybe you could do an office. There's so many things you can do with it, but it's perfect for just a nice grand piano in here. So this room really just finishes off the nice formal area that you have in this house. So we're gonna go over here. We're gonna check out the office slash gym. It could be used for whatever you'd like. Let's go see it. So this room is really nice. It's on the ground level. It's got tiled floors, so it would be great for a gym. It'd be great for an office. It could be really anything you'd want it to be, but just it just really is a nice area for a gym or an office, in my opinion. And then over here, we've got this really beautiful powder room. Come check out this design. So the powder room, I really love this room. The first time I came in here, I was like, this just gives off such a nice vibe. It's like luxurious. You get the really nice lighting with the crystals here. You've got a black tiled. It's like a stone. It's really nicely textured. It gives off some nice texture in the room. This is black granite, as well as the black cabinetry with the floating shelves. I really, really like it. Let's go over here and check out the guest bedroom. So we're here on the first level still in the guest bedroom down here. This is the guest bathroom. It's really nice. I love the color of the quartz countertops in here next to the white cabinetry. It's really pretty. And then right here, if you look, you've just got this really nice neutral toned marble. The mar You don't see a lot of marble anymore, um, especially in just like nice luxurious homes nowadays. So it's really, really beautiful. It's really nice. They did a great job on it. Let's go over here and just check out the bedroom space. So what's nice about this bedroom is it actually has private access to the courtyard. So if you have guests and they need to come in and out without disturbing anybody, they are allowed to do that and they are not going to bother anybody. So it's a great space in here, a lot of nice natural light. You've got all the greenery from the courtyard around you. It's really, really pretty. All right, I think we should go and check out the kitchen now because it's really beautiful. All right, guys, let's go see this kitchen. But first, and I just wanna stop and appreciate this really beautiful bar area. I love this black and white granite. You've got the wine fridge, you've got all of your drawers and storage and your floating shelves. It's really, really nice touch for when you're coming in here, this beautiful open kitchen. Again, you've got the uniform from the bar to the island. It's got a really nice black granite. It's big, you can have a ton of food out here. Really great for entertaining. I love the contrast here of the white and the dark, personally. I just, I love that they, you don't see it a lot, so it really pops out. You've got the brass toned hardware. You've got the black sink, which is really nice. You can look out into the side of the house, which has some great greenery. You've got the awesome four top burner with the really pretty gold uh, handles here. So that's like really, really nice. And you've got the griddle, it looks like in the middle. Oh yeah. Perfect for cooking. Of course, all of these cabinets are brand new. It's custom, It's everything touches soft touch. So it's really nice. We've got the beautiful monogram ovens here. Really, really nice KitchenAid fridge, all stainless steel, all matching, of course. And so the kitchen really just flows nicely into this beautiful open living room. I really love this room. The black stone fireplace, it's floor to ceiling. So it just really makes this wall look really tall. You've got the electric fireplace, so the ambiance in here is beautiful. During the day, you've got a great amount of natural light coming through through the sliders, which lead to the backyard, and we will go check that out later. But I just wanna to continue to show you the rest of this beautiful kitchen. When you come back through here, you actually walk past the walk-in pantry, 
You got a really cute little kitchen nook here that you can look out to the courtyard. You got a really nice like butler's pantry, little countertop here, really nice cabinets. And then over here, you've got the laundry room. So really good size open laundry room, lots of storage. You've got a lot of countertop space, the sink. There's even a drying hanger, which I can speak for myself when I say <laughs> this is really nice. It's a really nice little touch that they did. I like it a lot. All right, I think we should go check out the rest of the house upstairs where all of the bedrooms are, and then we'll also get to the casita later as well. All right, guys, here on the second floor, we've got a beautiful custom wrought iron uh, railing here on the staircase, so it's really nice. Over here, we're gonna check out the two guest bedrooms on this level. On this side, I love this room. It's so cute in here. I really, really like like the pitched ceilings. And you also just have such a natural, amount of natural light coming in is great. So it could be a cute kid's room, maybe a playroom. You've got built-in shelving over here. So really just a lot of things this room could be. We're gonna walk over here. Got a really nice walk-in closet. So really good size closet for this room. Over here, we've got a Jack and Jill bathroom that leads to the other bedroom. Here we are in the bathroom. It's really cute in here. You've got really nice pendant lighting. You've got the quartz countertops, black and white, really modern. Walk through here. We're gonna go to the other bedroom. We've got a nice shared combo bathtub shower, uniform countertops with the white cabinets. This bedroom's slightly different as it's not like, you know, we don't have the pitch ceilings, but it's really a good size room in here. This room is bigger than the last one. Get a nice view out here, greenery, looking over the walking path that we'll kind of talk about later. You've got the walk-in closet. We're gonna go check out the other side of the house, which is one of my favorite parts. We've got the loft and the primary suite. All right, here we are. We've got the nice loft, kind of media hangout area. Let's check out this little outdoor space here. This is nice. You can open up both the doors. Okay, maybe you, yeah, I think you can open up that door. You've got a nice little Romeo and Juliet balcony. You've got nice greenery out here. So this will be nice. You can open it up. You can entertain. You've got some nice airflow. Everyone can get some outdoor space while being upstairs. And this room is just really cool. There's so many things you can do with it. Um, my first thought would be a really nice, some nice comfy couches, make this kind of like a theater media room. You've got a really nice long countertop space over here with the nice, custom cabinetry, everything is smooth, refrigerator, sink, everything's just here. So you've got, you've got tons of options to make this space whatever you want. I'm gonna walk over here to the primary suite. I do just wanna point out this cool feature. So there's actually a washer and dryer hookup right here. So then you can have the washer and dryer up here as well. So you have to walk up and down the stairs, but let's go check out this primary suite. It's pretty special. All right, here we are. One of my favorite rooms in this house. The atmosphere in here with this floor to ceiling, stone fireplace, it's electric, but you've got the nice light coming out of there. This room is just so much light. You've got the really nice shutters so you can make it dark or light. What they put in here is this really pretty gold, these gold pendant lighting, which is really cool because if you have your bed right here, you've already got some really nice lighting in here. Really makes it modern. Over here, I lied, this is my favorite part of the house. Ah, I love this bathroom. So right here you've got really, really pretty shower. It's wood-like tile. So I'll just step in here really quick just to kind of show you. But it's really pretty. It's like spa-like in here. You've got two shower heads, so everyone can get showered quickly, be done with that. You've got a really, really, just like a great flow in here. The lighting in this bathroom is something else. I feel like every woman, you've got dark, warm, like fluorescent. So perfect for makeup, lots going on here, I love it. Really beautiful countertops here with the granite. You've got the uniform white cabinetry all the way throughout. So everything in the house just matches and flows really nicely. Over here, we've got that wood-like tile again. I really, really like this. I thought it was wood at first, so it's doing its job. Um, but the soak-in tub is um, incredible. With the window right here, you've got the privacy, but you've got a really nice amount of light coming in here. I'm gonna go over here. We've got our second vanity. Lots of shelves, lots of kick storage, lots of everything. It's perfect. Over here, we've got two walk-in closets. Let's go check them out. All right, let's check out this first closet. I really, really love this. First of all, you have access to the balcony, so that's kind of cool. You need to just get out and get some fresh air. You've got the built-in drawers. Everything's finished in here for you. Plenty of space. 
But my favorite part is that there's a second walk-in closet, which again, is actually a very good size, finished. So you've got his and her closets, goes all the way back, plenty of storage space, plenty of things to work with in here. You've got the built-in drawers already, so you don't have to worry about dressers. It's beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. All right, I think we should go check out the outdoor areas and the casita. Here we are, we're in the casita. This is on the second level of the house. So you've got private stairs that walk up here. Nice little wet bar right here. You've got the refrigerator and sink. So it's really perfect for guests. They can keep their refreshments up here. Come on in here, we've got a little private bathroom. It's great for guests. Like this is great for guests, maybe older teenagers or older kids, anyone who's staying here who just needs their own space. You've got this really good sized bedroom. You fit a nice king bed in here. Nice neutral tile. You can put a lot of different kind of furniture in here. Nice light coming through. Honestly, this house, what I love the most, because you don't see it a lot, is the greenery. You've got mature landscaping, and we will talk about that later when we go through the garden area. You get a nice little balcony out here. You can put a little chair, a little table. So it's really cute. All right, that was it for the casita. Really like that area. As I mentioned earlier, you do have that private staircase from the courtyard so you've got the nice private access in and out i really like this courtyard you have all these mature trees the landscaping out here is beautiful you can hang out by the wood burning fireplace and have a nice glass of wine or a cup of coffee in the morning and just enjoy yourself come on over here you've got the gate this is the front entrance to the house so it's a really nice entrance for you know when you walk in it's really beautiful it's always nice to have nice curb appeal and a really cool little area you don't really see a lot of in houses. It's this nice sitting area. So you've got a little built-in bench, tons of seating, nice shade from the trees. It's really, really pretty. A nice little garden area over here. It's just really tranquil out here. Trinkle. <laughs> it's just really tranquil out here, which is not, in, in Vegas, you don't get a lot of greenery. So it's really nice and refreshing out here. We're gonna walk over here. We're gonna check out the little sports area and the pool's back here too. So I'm really excited to show you. All right, so we're gonna walk through the little garden here. I really just felt like kicking my shoes off so I could just like really feel the grass. It's really nice back here. Look at all this garden area. They've already got the wooden crates out here, with the soil. It's just like, you don't see a garden very often, but I think just this house, it just really matches this house. So it's really pretty. You've got the wood over here for your wood burning fireplace. Ooh, I think this is a pomegranate tree. Yes, please. That is so cool. Got a nice pomegranate tree back here. I feel like I'm walking through like a romantic garden. And then, you know, cause what romantic garden doesn't need a nice basketball area, sports area. This is really, really cool. So if you got kids or just guests over here that like wanna play sports, play basketball. And what's really cool about this backyard, besides the fact that there's so much greenery, is that you've got private access to the walking path in the neighborhood. So that's really, really nice. You can get up in the morning or night, take your little walk. You don't have to go all the way through the neighborhood. Look at this big tree. So much shade back here. This is really nice. Let's go check out the pool. All right, guys, so here we are at this beautiful pool. It's a really good size. It's really unique, but also what's so nice about it is they actually just refinished it. So it's new tile, brand new refinished area. So you don't have to worry about any cracking or anything like that. You've got the spa over here that just really flows nicely. So it's just, just a great area for entertaining. Honestly, this backyard is probably one of my favorites we've ever, ever done. And that's about it for this tour. All right, guys, that is it for this beautiful home. I want to thank Lisa Hunt. She's the listing agent for this property. Thank you for letting us show this beautiful home. Of Please course. let everybody know where they can find your information. Um, if you feel free to email me or call me, my phone number is 702-285-7491 or email lisa at deluzedreamhomes.com. All right, there you have it. Her information will be below as well as in the description. Thank you again for watching. Of course, as always, if you like what you saw, please hit the like and subscribe and we'll see you next time. All right, here we are on the second level. Love these wrought iron, this, sorry. All right, here on the second floor. I love these wrought iron. This is a cost custom. <laughs> ah! Damn, okay. We're gonna get it, we're gonna get it. I'm so hot. <laughs> So yeah, we're in here and we got the bathrooms that are both giant. We got. <laughs> sorry, 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 it's my fault.